How's it going, everybody? Poser Mobile here, bringing you another absolute banger of a platinum. Today, we've got another one from Zitalon called Two Faced, and you're looking at three bucks on the PlayStation Store with four total stacks. It's a Zitalon game, people, so you know what that means. Your only friend is your cross button, and you might need to take a break at some point so you don't snap your controller in half. If you want more of these games and enjoy today's video, please let me know by leaving a like, letting me know in the comments which games I should make trophy guides for next, and subscribing to the channel for more trophy hunting content. Alright, I'm going to be straight with you, this is a rough one. If you check this game out on PSN profiles and look at the time to platinum, you'll see that there's basically three ways this can go for you. You can get ridiculously lucky and finish this in a few minutes. You might have to just grind it out over the better part of an hour, or this could be the game that breaks you as a trophy hunter. You're essentially playing Snake, but you're constantly turning clockwise and gaining speed the longer you go without picking up an apple. If that's not enough, there's a second screen that links with the other one, so when you go through the top of one screen, you'll end up on the bottom of the other. Trophy-wise, honestly, the only thing that's really going to matter here is to survive for 60 seconds. There's trophies for eating 30 total apples across all playthroughs, getting to a times 30 bonus, and getting to a score of 200, all of which I stumbled my way through trying to survive for a minute. Alright, so as far as the strat for this goes, your snake will increase in size when you eat an apple, but eating an apple will also reset your speed back down to the baseline. So try to avoid eating an apple for as long as you can until you're almost catching your own tail while just spinning in a circle. Doing it this way will eat up a bunch of time, and honestly, going off the screen just felt like a death sentence because it gets real chaotic real fast, especially if you're anywhere near the corners. Again, unless you're ridiculously lucky with this, it's going to take some time and some genuine frustration to finish. Going in completely blind, it took me the better part of a half hour to unlock everything. Honestly, go for the times 30 trophy and score trophies first and just see if you manage to survive for 60 seconds while going for those. If you don't manage it, at least you'll have a feel for the controls and the speed the snake gains over time so you'll be able to better gauge your apple grabs. If you do decide to go for this, I'll apologize up front. I wish you the best of luck and I believe in you. If I can do this, you can too. Trust me, I might be making guides in these one-button games, but I'm in no way good at them. That'll do it for me though, everybody. If you enjoyed today's video, leave a like, comment down below which number platinum this was for you, and subscribe to the channel for more trophy hunting content. This was number 934 for me.